we're here continuing in the Rosette Isabel uh, culvert. So I've actually switched my grindstone over here to the electric type. Um, because, yeah, it's, it's weird that it took me so long to realize it. Yeah, but the, the puppets are weak to electricity. So if I'm indeed seeing puppets again, I want to at least, you know, have the tactical advantage of using electric against them instead of fire. That dude wants me to find his wife. Oh, look at this. We got some hangers over here. Eh. Anybody on the ground? Oh, there is one on the ground. Oh, well. What the heck that dude just hit me with? Actually hurt a little more than I was expecting. Oh, it's like a dead end over here. Actually, wait a minute. No, not really. There's an enemy down there. Shit, but do I want to go down or do I... I think I want to be checking this way first before I head down. Oh wait, that's... Is that leading outside? Oh, that is, no, that is outside. Okay, no. Let's let's check down low first before we head outside. All right, looked like there was something sitting right there. So, wait, what? How did I not land on him with that attack? Oh, it's one of those, like, big guys from the beginning that I had a little bit of experience with. Hold on. Not that one. I'm not used to that one. The slower one I can do, I think. Oh. Completely whiffed that one. I didn't quite have that one as well as I thought I did. Oh, okay, there's a... He was protecting a chest, that's... oh. Oh, this was just on the other side of the the white lady. All right, so now we're outside of the sewer. That just missed. Okay, wait a minute! Whoa, 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 whoa! With the attack. Oh, this is a, a beefy one. Oh, oh, huh? 
Whoo. That is a headless freaking puppet about fucking took me out. Oh, this is a shortcut right back to that, uh, right back to the man uh, from the beginning who wants me to find his wife. That's what those things do, they blow up. Okay, I've killed them so fast, I didn't even know what the hell they did. They're suicide bombers. Oh, no wonder they take like one hit to kill. Because they could do a hell of a lot more damage to me, shit. You fucking prick. He got really? That was unnecessary. Ah, no, no, no. Now I know to actually string you and just kill you. I guy was over here somewhere, wasn't he? I'll mess up your favorite table. And your favorite chair. I'm not sure which one it was, but I messed it all up for you. How you like that? Huh? Shithead. Oh, now I got flamethrower ones, huh? Damn. Rosa Isabel Street. Oh, yeah, look at that. The big, the big fireball trap. Got more of these stationary thrower guys over here. Oh, this should be fun. Can't hit them with that because they, uh, they're going to sit still. Oh, oh, so they're changing their guns for flamethrowers. Okay. Is this some sort of joke? Oh my god. Well, that just happened. It's my first non-boss death. And it was for fucking stupid reasons. My goddamn weapon hit the fucking wall. Kept that one douche alive. Oh, I'm pissed off. That was totally unnecessary. I even saw it too. I was like, let me just pull this guy towards me. Let me just kill him. And the fucking wall stopped him from actually getting to me. Caused my first fucking non-boss death. That is so irritating. It was unnecessary. Alright, so I just kill you flat out. You don't blow up anyway. And there was another shooter, because I, uh, there was two of them, the other one killed me. You know what? We're only gonna fucking save you this time, asshole.
definitely a good thing I'm putting more capacity on. Oof, flamethrower. Oh, wait a minute. The black dress. But it's just a puppet? What on earth is going on? But that man seemed like a straight up human. So he was he was in love with a puppet. Okay. I guess to each his own. I mean, these people feel for these puppets, like, oh, what's his name, Vanini with Pulcinella. You know, they feel for the puppets, so, I mean, but, I mean, marriage, I mean, I guess. It's that lonely in this kind of world. I believe this is the very beginning of Rosa Isabel Street. It is. All right. I'll just go ahead and take this, uh, use this save point. Not too many enemies. Not too difficult. So he gave me back the wedding ring. I mean, I definitely did lie to him because I didn't see a message. But I was not want to tell him. But it was, you know, unheard of for a human to fall in love with a puppet. And because I'm a special puppet, I can do that, huh? I can lie to the poor guy. Alright, so now it looks like it's time to deal with the friggin' the fire path. Now, I do remember that giant boulder, which no doubt will fall. Let me see if I can safely backstab this guy. Okay. I cannot. Alright, that, that thing is going to come down, but it looks like there's some safety over here on the side of this bridge. Oh, that would have ran right into that dude, too. Alright. So there's a thrower over here. More flamethrowers. Oh, whoa, 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 okay, the flamethrowers see me, okay. Okay, that was almost perfect. I actually nailed them both with two of those three hits. This one right here just happened to miss that third hit. Alright, so these guys right here should... What the fuck is that? That must have been what pushed the damn boulder. Is he... Boxing? Oh. Well. I'll deal with him when I get up there. Oh, that motherfucker's coming down here. Dude, it's a boss? What the shit kind of boss is, is down in there? What? What the hell kind of boss is down here in an area like this? I mean, if he is a boxer, he's got the strength for it. Oh. 
Oh, one more hit, he should be dead. I didn't even know that dude was like creeping towards me because, I mean, he fucking hurts. But this street had freaking throwers and flamethrowers. It's not a horrible place for a fucking boss to be just like creeping up on you. I mean, I'm kind of, I'm kind of fortunate I really didn't pay him no mind. I was just focused on taking care of the people on the street. I didn't even know he was coming at, he was coming out of here towards me. All right, so that's actually going to do it for this, for this video. Had a, that was just weird. It was like just two kind of out of the, uh, out of the blue bosses. Uh, one from the last video and one on this one. This one was a, a bit weirder considering it was, I mean, it was just down this strip of a whole, I mean, a, a slew of enemies that would have caused a problem for me if I really didn't, uh, if I actually had noticed the boss. But he was lurking at me once I, I guess I reached a certain point in the road. He just started creeping his way towards me. Fortunately, I noticed him when I was just about finished up with all the enemies over there. But that one wasn't, that one wasn't that bad. I, I couldn't figure out his timing on his attacks. I just kind of attacked and blocked what I could. I think I got like one, I think I actually, you know, I perfect blocked like one of his moves. Obviously, it was by complete accident, but... This electric blitz thing really helped, and this weapon, again, is just freaking god tier. I love it. Um, anyway, that'll do it for this video. I will enter this very elaborate looking building in the next video. Until next time, hope you all have a wonderful day, and take care.